morning. Hi everyone. Um, thanks for signing up for this May session. Um, we'll see how this goes. Um, as usual, um, you know, make it your own. Um, if you're um, with me today and need a chair, of course, that you know, do whatever is appropriate for you, you know, today. Um, find what feels good. Um, I miss you all. I can't wait till we can be back in class together. Um, <sighs> hope you're all well and, um, you know, plugging along and finding new, new things and um, learning new things. It's a good opportunity. Um, so here we here we go. We're gonna go ahead and get started um, in um, our recline position. So let's go ahead and hit the ground or your chair wherever you are. Um, you know, as usual, have um, you know if you need a pillow for your head at any time or for your hips when we're seated. Um, blocks if you know if you have them or maybe just stacked um, I don't know books I don't know how sturdy that would be but um, all right here we go so lying down quieting things getting into this moment of curiosity. Keep learning. Um, we know, you know, we know yoga helps us feel better, you know, on lots of levels. And whatever, you know, brings you to yoga. If it's more for the physical, you know, aspect and effect. If it's for the, you know, the peaceful, tranquil effect, or maybe a combination of, of everything, um, you know, really notice how it helps uncover um, that which, you know, we already have, what we already possess. But, you know, maybe seeing things in a new way, a new light, right? Continuing to learn, shed light, um, you know, on those dark corners. And to keep growing, keep things fresh and interesting, right? Um, so maybe that's, you know, our intention today as we practice. Um, with a curiosity, a wonder, an awe of what, you know, what is possible um, when we really listen and observe with an attentive, you know, eye and ear and mind. So... under us, beneath us, checking in with our breath, maybe close eyes at this point, start to capture, again, the wonder, the awe, the beauty of the breath. completely. We'll open the floodgates of the breath. Let's stretch those legs out. Stretch the arms overhead. In some way, you know, if you need to keep a bend in your arms, anything going on in your shoulders, maybe impingements, just find a good half 
happy, creating space. Maybe, um, you know, once you kind of loosen things up, maybe you connect your fingers at the top, stretch, maybe elbows bend, reaching out a bit, taking the shape of an O here, through the arms, abdominals drawing down and in, pull the toes forward, legs come a little closer together, let's stretch now, pull those knuckles away, reaching in opposite directions, inhale, exhale, soften, let the shoulders just melt down away from the ears, inhale again, stretch, exhale, soften, one more, inhale, Feel some energy down through the legs. Now take it over to the side. Inhale, exhale, release back to center. Inhale, reach to the other corner. Hips and feet maybe reaching the other way. Exhale, release back to center. Inhale, back through center, stretch. Now release, pull your right knee in, circle around your shin, draw a knee to chest. Inhale again, stretch. Fingertips might touch or intertwine. Reach overhead, exhale, switch. Left knee. So that's the movement now. Inhale, pull yourself long. Exhale, switch. So your option to really take that knee in. Again, finding what feels good feels good through your back and your hips to really hug tight or maybe it's just a very soft touch again curiosity listening feeling observing Smoothing out the breath, inhalation, exhalation. Again, opening the floodgates of the breath. A couple more rounds. Let's finish on the left knee, so your front knee closest to me here. So give it a good hug, stretch. Pull the right foot in, bending that knee, dropping down with the shoulders, release from the ears, settling in. So pressing strong through that back foot, belly drops down and in, let's kick this foot up. Leg up the wall, stretch, massage. Maybe that hip. So we'll keep this foot pressing that ceiling up, rooting down strong through your core, your hips, that back foot. Take your front hand to the inside of this thigh. Let's roll it out on the inhale. Again, take it slow. Exhale, push across. Maybe switch hands, find that good stretch through that glue, this IT band. Try not to roll off that hip, it's not, not a twist. Inhale again, open back up, exhale. So get both hands you know, ready, assisting. Keep dropping abdominals down and in, we wanna brace our back. Again, nice rooted um, center trunk. So it's more of a leg and a hip. Less, you know, not a twist here. So we're back, one more. Exhale back to center. Let's pull that knee back in. Again, bend, release. Now switch hands again, cross over to that thigh. We're gonna roll it over to a twist. So we're taking it to the back. So again, pull the hips down, draw your belly in. Think of lengthening through your, your ribs, your spine. Maybe this front arm opens up, head rolls to the front. 
to our full twist now. So now we're in that twist, ringing out. Again, flood the breath in. Shoulders drop. And release. So find your way back to center. Reset. Maybe lift your hips. Again, a little hug just to release that back. Switch feet. Let's take right knee in. Hug. And then this was leg up the wall. So now your back leg or, or switch if you're on a different leg here. So again, a little priming. So now we, you know, we set it up. Anchor down, find some good, you know, traction through your core. We're back to the breath. So, so your back hand to the inside, that's our rolling out. Push out through your heel. Um, roll your pinky toe out. Exhale back to center. And, and across for a little more. Again, if it feels good. Again. Gain attention. Again, with curiosity. Less about accomplishing and Perfecting. Last one. Exhale. And, and, and we're back to center again. Bend that knee. Hug. This was our twist. So knee over your hip. Chris, or, so your opposite hand takes that outer thigh. You roll into the front now to that twist. So you're crossing the, you know, the center midline. Stacking the hips. Back arm opens up for that fuller. Open shoulder, open heart. Maybe head rolls to the back. Breathe again, that flooding breath into your trunk, into the ribs, down into that hip. Breath, reach in again to the tight spots, dark spots, and release. So find your way back again, support, especially your low back. So you're back to center again, hug. We'll capture both knees, take a good little pump here. We'll be rocking up into our seated. So take your time, maybe roll over to your side, uh, find your way here. I like to do that rocking, loosen up the hips, take your comfortable seated. So this is your, you know, modifying to make it comfortable for you. We don't, you know, need to be miserable here. If it's a day, your hips are you know, looking for a little more space. Maybe foot comes on top, maybe out in front. So uh, again, checking in to the consciousness, the rhythm, the beauty of the breath. The magic of the breath. You know, when we bring our focus there, it can change the whole perspective, the whole world. An attitude shapes shapes our world. So again, you're comfortable seated because we'll be here for a little bit. So warming our neck, we're circling. Um, again, in your feel good way, listen, feel, observe. Again, with curiosity, wonder. 
there's always room for adjustment modifying to again to honor our condition our reality so it might be you know a real tiny circle painting with our nose maybe it's big a couple more Find your way back to center, regroup, rising up through the front body, ground through your back body. Drop those shoulder blades down, kind of in to your mid back. Now remember which way you were going before, switch that direction. Back with the breath, inhale up and around, exhale down and around. Try to keep your shoulders level, a good wisdom and awakening in your core. One more. And back to center, reset. So right into shoulder rolls now, those big, scoopy, loopy, massaging, a couple more. Last one, dropping down. Now cats and cows, hands, you know, at your knees, we're pulling our heart up. Um, our are opening that front body, squeezing your shoulder blades together. Exhale now, reverse. Carving out your belly, even your chest. Inhale, open. Exhale. Think of suctioning in your, your gut. Even as we open forward. Corset of our ribs, our center, last one. Exhale, release, empty that breath again, reset. Um, hands come back, it's open. So you're on your fingertips, walking your shoulder blades together like you're trying to hook them, kiss, kissing. Float your chin up, inhale, exhale, sweep the hands around, pushing your hips back, nice forward fold, a couple more, inhale, the heart shine, exhale, again that slow, slow and steady, and wise, one more. Maybe this one, your hips float a bit more. Exhale. So let's sweep it back again. We'll unfold our legs. Um, so you can touch your feet down, your toes down. If you want a little more, lift them up. Or modified boat. Shins level. Again, maybe toes down. Even if you're in the chair, you can lean back. Lift your heart, breathe. Now um, we're gonna switch feet. So bring your other leg in front. It might feel a little awkward. Again, walk those hips. Maybe this one, your foot comes up. Um, you can find what feels um, appropriate, you know, even though it's going to feel a little odd because it's not your, your normal, you know, go-to. Let's swim those hands back again. Same flow here. Inhale, open, shine. Exhale again, that slow and steady forward. Hips roll and press back. Inhale again. Open. 
exhale. And again, find something new. Can you kiss your abdominals into your, your back? Last one here again. Find your way back up. And again, our center. So we're back to our boat to kind of kick out from there. If you want to do a little flutters, maybe a little walking again. Curiosity. Make it your own. Maybe feet are down. Again, support your back if it's a, you know, a tender back day. Honor that. Maybe you're ready for a little more heat. Find your full boat. Inhale. Exhale. Release. Find your way all the way, you know, all the way down again. We're going to turn over. And let's step right up into our down dog, if you can, our downward puppy. Um, again, with curiosity. Push that mat forward. Kind of clawing in through the your fingerprints. You're walking it out. Shining your hips. Greeting all the moving parts. Maybe the chattering parts. We'll find our way down. So take your time again, slow and steady. Thoughtful. One knee comes down and the other toes come down. Walk your hands more under your shoulders, right into our, our fours now for cats and cows. Roll the heart forward, sinking the belly, flaring the tail, chin. Exhale, curl the spine up, cat. Inhale, cow, stretch. Exhale. Couple more. The wonder and, again, beauty of the breath meets the wisdom of our body. So back to um, table here. Now child's pose. Roll those hips back. Press through your toes. Stretch. Forehead down. Drawing abdominals in. Again, we want to kiss, kiss them to your back. Um, squeeze um, into that midline. So again, the corset of your your ribs hugging in to really, you know, uh, tap into the, you know, the magic and strength of your, your core. We're going to take it to a plank flow here. So again, do what you can. If you're using a chair, we can do this, you know, um, with hands on the seat of the chair. Coming forward and back. Inhale, exhale, pumping our heart, our um, shoulders, our spine, our back. Couple more. Inhale, exhale, inhale, and exhale. And again, let it out. So we're coming back, walk the hands a little bit closer, knees under your hips. Let's scoop the left or your front foot up with that knee bent. Just one big sunbird here. Wiggle the toes, kind of pump a few times just to get a little momentum going. We're going to scoop this leg forward all the way to the top. Um, 
between your hands, kneeling lunge. So move that left hand or front hand out. So framing our foot, pushing through the feet, front and back. Roll the heart forward, soften the shoulders, dig that back, um, thigh downward, lunge, kneeling lunge, inhale, exhale, roll the hips back, toes up, or half split, stretch in through the back, back of the leg, hello, hamstring, inhale again, walk back down, heart forward, so your back hand down, um, front hand to hip, in a fist twist. So revolve inch, open the heart over that thigh. Exhale, release. We're stepping front foot back. And again, you're back to uh, child's pose. Sit back, hips down. Inhale, plank. Exhale, back. Um, maybe it's just table that you're coming to. Again, you're modified. Again, keep hugging in um, to your that midline, the corset of your ribs. So we're moving with intention, with purpose, you know, making it meaningful. We're here really, you know, learn everything that we can. One more. So how does it feel in your low back? Exhale back. So you're back to that kind of modified table. And then it's back leg up, bend the leg. It's a little sunbird. So just a few little pumps just to, again, kind of ignite, find that and then we're kicking it forward, scoop it through, however you can get, get there. Hands frame that foot, shine your heart forward. Maybe this one, you're more on your fingertips. That back hip might be a little tighter. Remember knee over ankle. Again, press through your toes, bring some energy, again, some magic of um, intention. So everything, you know, balances out and blends in, in harmony. Inhale, exhale, your, your half split. So toes are up. Again, slow and steady. We're not crunching or, you know, forcing anything. You might kind of move a little bit. Maybe this hamstring needs a little massage. So find your way back again, slow and steady. Inhale, exhale. Shoulders down. This was our revolved. So your back hand to your hip in a light fist, revolve the heart over that thigh, over the hip. Squeeze that elbow across your back. Inhale, exhale, release. Let's step the front foot back, hands down. You're back to your down dog or puppy. Stretch it up, walk the feet. Maybe this one feels different, feels fresher, easier, lighter. Maybe a little less clunky. Let's take that slow, steady walk up. Maybe it's a little kick up in the back. Walking that tightrope. Um, let's turn to face each other here. Stay low. Again, kind of getting our feet uh, rooted down, building that foundation. Find a good width that you know, stabilizes you. And then your slow roll up. Rise in from the ground up through center. 
Again, that hugging in. Slowly rolling. Eventually, shoulders. So feet smoothing out beneath you. Hips rooting down and rising up through center and across the front body, grounding through the back body. Again, new, new day, new perspective, new curiosities, especially in this new time where forced to face, it's teaching us a lot, um, hopefully you know, reminding us to keep learning um, new things, learning what we're made of, um, and what, you know, <laughs> what really we can handle, um, and to keep nourishing self. Um, this is, I think, why we probably come back to yoga time and again, because we um, appreciate the, um, the effects and the, um, yeah, the magic of it. So keep it up. I appreciate you um, and your body appreciates you. Um, so back to breath. Let's sweep it up. Inhale. Exhale. Again, the floodgates of the breath. Inhale. Almost halfway. Inhale. Exhale. Now this one. Inhale. Inhale. Interlace at the top. Exhale. Relax the shoulders. Elbows kind of bend. Now inhale. Up. Stretch. Push the feet down. Exhale. Soften. Inhale again. Up. Exhale. This one, inhale, up. Exhale, bend. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. And again, inhale, up. Exhale. Now this one, inhale, up. Exhale. Dive it all the way down. Reach for your feet. Bend your knees. Heart touches thighs. Crown hangs. Inhale, half fold. Hands to your shins or your thighs. You know, just kind of depends on your back. Find what feels good. Think of having kind of a flat back. Um, eyes are down, so your neck is in that nice, smooth line with your spine. Thighs rise. Inhale, exhale, soften. Now, Again, kiss your abdominals back into your back. Press through all four corners of the feet. We're taking that big sweep up. Big inhale. Exhale, soften. Inhale again, stretch. Exhale, release. Dive it down, fold. Inhale, half. Exhale, fold. Inhale again, rise. Exhale, soften. Inhale, stretch. Exhale again, dive it down. The floodgates open. Inhale, half. Exhale, fold. Inhale, up. Exhale again, soften. Inhale, stretch. Exhale again, dive it down. Push your hips back. Head hangs. Inhale, half. Stretch. Again, find something new. Another inch. Exhale, fold. Soften. One more round. Inhale. Exhale, soften. Almost like you're putting a crown on your head. Inhale, stretch. Exhale again. Dive it down. Let it go. So we're staying down. Now turn, shift to the front of your mat. Hands down. Let's step front foot back. So 
you're kind of kicking it back as far back, right into a lunge. Wiggle that foot back, pull your heart forward. So you might be knee down if you're feeling good. Stay strong here, hugging into that midline. Now again, knee might come down. We're back to that twist. So your back hand to your hip, we're revolving. Heart. Exhale, release, hand down. Walk the hands forward. You're stepping back, foot up. So meet the front, hang low. Inhale, half stretch. Exhale again, soften and fold. Now your back foot steps back to your lunge. Again, take your time, slow and steady. See how you're doing here? Maybe it's knee down. Remember you have that option. Again, curiosity. So opposite hand down, front hand to your hip. Revolve. Heart. Release. And again, that walk up with your hands. Kick that back foot up. Wiggle the toes. And again, knead it up to the front. And we're back in our fold. Now again, kiss your abdominals in. Let's take that big sweep up. The floodgates of the breath. Inhale. Exhale, soften. And again, place that crown to your head. And then bring it all the way to heart. Palms together. Palms kissing. Shoulders relax. Check in again with the, the magic. Um, ignited. So this brings us into our warrior uh, flow. So your front foot steps back. Warrior one. So we're facing the front edge of the mat, pushing our knee to the ankle and pushing this um, back heel down. So hands to heart, push into your pinky toes. Now sweep the hands up. And again, we're interlacing, soften, inhale up, exhale, sweep open. And again, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, release. Now swim your hands back. And again, what, whatever just works for you, might be hands to hips, might be interlaced, might be um, to your low back. I'm gonna try holding on. So this is our opener. Push that, um, your foot forward, stretching the mat. Inhale. Exhale now, just release that. Hands find the ground again, so you're coming down. You're back to the lunge. Heel up. Now walk your hands forward. We're gonna try our, our balance here. It's a standing split. So you're kicking that back leg up. Feel that heat, appreciate that. So how high can we rise that leg up? Maybe a little um, micro bend in that front leg, push your heart to your thigh. And then let's bend that knee, step it forward to meet the front foot. You're back to your stand in fold. Kiss your abdominals in. Let's take that sweep up. Slow, slow rise. Exhale, heart. So again, soften and capture. Again, the magic and the energy that probably, you know, was that front leg. So we're switching that out, that warrior. Um, so let's, let's switch um, sides here, get back. So we're, you know, we're stepping the front foot now back. 
So that was our warrior one. Um, so again, we're on that train track now. Strong, bend that front knee, find your ground. Rise the front body, ground through the back body. Let's sweep it up. Inhale, exhale, soften. So it's this beautiful balance and marriage of strength, but ease. Inhale, exhale. Are we strong in our footing? Strong in our awareness? Whatever comes to the surface. Exhale. Inhale up. Last one. Exhale. So again, give the shoulders a little roll. See, you know, where you can get these hands. It might be more of that superhero. If this feels good to crunch the knuckles down. Inhale. Exhale now, heart forward. We're leaning over that front leg to reach for ground. Back heel is up now in our lunge. So again, a little flushing. And then it's that walk forward, powering up that front leg. Again, do what you can. Maybe it's just a little shuffle of the back foot. If you have a little mobility, to rise that back leg, see how high you can get. Push your heart in. And then bend that knee. And we'll kind of <clears throat> step that foot up to meet. Um, so again, we're back in our fold. Ground through your feet. Let's take that slow rise up, sweeping the hands, slow and steady. Palms kiss, exhale, bring it to heart. Again, our kissing palms. And again, capturing the magic, the beauty, the energy that is the experience. So let's turn back together here to our wide straddle. Um, so nice and wide, our nice sunflowers. Um, so a little shift, greet those legs and hips, see how your knees are doing today. Again, from seated is fine too. Make sure you're pushing more into the back edges of your feet. That'll really you know, take pressure off your, your knees and, and set you up, you know, for a good um, st 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 stable joints. Um, so again, we, we're moving with intention, you know, meaningful breath and awareness and and appreciation, but um, meaningful core and um, and joints, you know, everything working in, in balance and harmony. Um, so our sunflowers, again, the, those big sweeping motions. Um, exhale, you're sweeping out. Now we're hinging forward. This is where, you know, the legs come in. So we're bending the knees. I'm slowing it down just to kind of demo the first couple of rounds. And then you'll find your rhythm. Think of pushing your, your, your knees out to your pinky toes. Again, powering into your feet. Abdominals kissing in. And again, this beautiful, um, marriage of the breath, that flooding breath, flooding light and wisdom and energy into the body and our spirit of curiosity, 
continue the journey, learning, growing, blossoming. A couple more. Last one. So let's stay down, stay low, reach for that ground. And then you'll wiggle your, your heels up and out. So your feet are more aligned, lift and stretch your toes apart, pull your big toes in towards the more towards the center, walk your hands forward. So we get a, a nice spaciousness across the back from your crown to your tail space across the uh, between the legs the hips belly lifts up and in stretch breathe move now again in a way that just feels good stretch from foot to foot heel to heel the animal lunge runner's lunge and then we're gonna um, kind of move around here. So we'll start, um, let's move this way. So you're, we're spinning around to our lunge. Um, and then got a little maneuvering here. Now that back knee comes down, press through your feet, walk your back hand in. So we're in a, um, a lizard, or horse. So we have this nice wide base. Um, wide front knee, back knee, heart draws forward. Now stay with me here. You're going to walk or kind of roll back on your back shin. So try to avoid your knee cap. And then you're gonna kick that heel or spin that back heel in. So kind of like a kickstand. Walk your hands around in front of that back knee. And then you're, you're extending this leg, this front leg, kind of on the inside of that foot. And then try to get your toes down. We're gonna be coming up if you can. Now, if you have any knee issues, you can come down onto your seat. This will be our rainbow. We do this, the modification would be in seated and then with one straddled leg. So we're rising up, squeeze again into that midline. So one hand down, now this outside hand rises up, inhale, exhale, float over. So this is our rainbow. So it might be heel down, again, find what works. Maybe there's a little bend in that knee. Um, just try to have the least amount of pressure on that knee, more on your shin and your back toes. Don't forget about your back foot. Again, pr um, meaningful, aware, are we using our core? Are we drawing the hips in together? One more. And stretch. We'll come up. So find your hands down again. You can bring that extended leg in. Um, so we need to spin around. So you're going to spin all the way around. Bring your foot. So now your um, back foot steps forward. And we're in that lunge again. That was our, our prep. So you can maybe start in the full, if you want that full version. And then back hand comes inside. So this was our, our version of lizard for that good hip um, opener. But again, we want to support So think of drawing, we're almost drawing the hips apart here and the knees, but again, in that stable, gentle way. And release. So again, now this back foot spins in, and it probably, you know, off your mat, you're walking your hands away. So I know it's a little tricky here. So again, you can be on your seat 
Um, you're trying to lengthen out that um, front leg. And again, find your shin, find those back toes, and then walk your way up. And this is where we're hugging into that midline to, you know, muster up that core power, integrity. Alright, cap, you know, our equilibrium and balance if you got a little dizzy there. And again, any little, you know, kinks or cramps or impingements, find a good, you know, maybe this is enough to lift up again, up through front body, ground through the back body. Sweep that outside arm up, inhale, exhale, again, rainbow. Move with the breath, again, that flooding the breath. Try to keep your heart revolved up. If it feels good to maybe turn the heart or the hand and your gaze towards that foot. To accentuate the rainbow here, make it a little brighter. Last one. Stretch. And again, we're up. Hand. Swing that front foot back and we'll turn carefully, come to your seat, refresh these knees now. If you're not already down, give them a little love, walk your hips a bit. Let's stretch the left leg out, give this knee a little hug, a toggle here. Breathe again, the beauty of the breath cures the wild mind. So let's slowly bring it down, soul to thigh, uh, kiss the foot and leg together, push this knee out, rise up through center, exhale, walk it down. Pouring your heart forward, again, roll your hips back, and again, the flooding breath. Flooding. Again, with light, love, good energy. Slowly bring it up. With this knee, give that a little, little pump again. We'll stretch that one out, switch it out. Yeah, maybe you're down, maybe it's hands behind. Your version of cradle. Grab that the outside of the foot, turn your arch in, lift your knee, careful. Our shoulders relax, the core engaged. So foot down, again, kissing, side of foot, knee pushes out, roll those hips back, nice long leg, this thigh, and we'll squeeze it back towards you, inhale up through center, exhale, and then continue, it's more of an exhaling breath now, remember that sinking, flooding breath. Good intake, let it that good, you know, out breath washes over. And then again, we roll up, float this knee, and again, 
if you feel like you need to stretch it out, maybe this hip. Uh, let's bring soles of the feet together, both feet. Walk the hips up and back. And it usually gets, you know, helps smooth out the weird little wrinkles. And just again, settle on the, just the rhythm of the breath, taming the, the chatter, the uncertainty, trust the wisdom of the breath. So if you feel like you need just a little more before we head down, if you want to pull your heart forward, get a little more into those hips, your option, a little flavor. So come back up, knees up, we'll roll it down, um, finding our way to our quiet spot here. So again, a little shuffle, smooth out, whatever little wrinkles kind of keep you from Embracing. Let's open the arms, nice big open T. Back, nice and open, heart. Inhale. Exhale, front knee comes into a nice hug. And again, maybe it's very soft. Kiss. So come back down again. Replace that foot down, arms open. Inhale, exhale, back knee. one wants a little extra. So again, we'll come back down, give the back a little tussle, shuffle the knees. And when you're ready, kick those legs out, shuffle out, smooth out, settling in, find a comfortable Arms settle, palms turn up, shoulders soften, melt. So come in. This is just quiet, simple, uncomplicated. destination, state of mind, peace, tranquil, and in awe and wonder.
light, to our love. As if we're we're kind of all in the room together, all in this together. stay as long as you as you wish otherwise we kind of shuffle wiggle the toes stretch new fingers maybe circle wrists <sighs> bring a smile to the surface from the inside out just the hands up and overhead stretch pull the feet in knees again we invite in take a couple little pumps shuffle a little bit move in some way that rocks you back to life back to your room and if you're down on the floor with me roll over to the front let your head rest a moment eyes sparkling back open give me a little smile I'm feeling feeling your um, love I super <laughs> appreciate you um, you know supporting me through all this and and you know trying this May class with me um, and you know again in this new way we'll be together again soon so let's find our way up for our wrap up here. So again, you're comfortable seated, sitting tall, bright. <sighs> Hands at our sides, inhale up. Again, the palms kiss back at the top. Exhale to heart with a smile and a new glow and radiance. Um, so the light in me thanks and honors and loves the light in you. We are light. Namaste all. Thank you so much. Um, have a beautiful day. See you next week. Bye.